Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Once again, I'm Nev from Nev's Tech, but today we're checking out the Redline Icon Pack. Yes, friends, if you have an Android, you can switch icons on your unit. That's one of the great things about having an Android. So let's just jump into it and have a look. It's rated pretty highly. There are some, uh, un unfortunately, there's some extra steps that you have to take to getting it going, and I'm going to go through that here. All kinds of great icons. If such a list. Already installed it, got it going, check it out. Rawr, like the looks of that lady right there. But as you can see, we have many custom icons for many different apps. Wi-Fi analyzer, private internet access. It's interesting that they managed to find or create icons for those little 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 known. Actually I shouldn't say little known, but people don't talk about them so much, but I guess they get a lot of use. Twitter. Skype, Facebook, at the bottom here we can see games like Doom 2, Fillmore Ago, uh, Symphony of the Night, lots of, lots of stuff. It's interesting, they get large selections of apps for particular icons, and then if they don't have the that particular icon, then they just put it in a box, a square, something like that. Here we have a look at all the icons that they have for my apps. They have a long, long, long list of icons that they custom made which is really cool it's normally about a buck fifty I got it on sale for a buck today and I thought I'd have a look and it is so nice the apps on it the the arts now in order to get this going there's something else you need to do there you have to download a launcher and then within the launcher you have to select the different icon packs so if we come over here second from the bottom left the apply arrow you have to download one of these launchers nova launcher is the best and the way that you do this is you go over to the play store and you look up nova launcher there's a premium version you don't need that one and then just open the nova launcher so right now this is running as a Nova launcher and uh, within the Nova launcher I've activated this red line so in order to gotta get to settings in order to change this settings and then we have to go to apps apps notifications and default apps Nova launcher and then yeah you have to click on Nova launcher if we go home now we'll see the apps as normal it kept the background then if we go back to Nova launcher whoop, back to Nova launcher and then we have my red line icon packs so that's how you do that you need the Nova launcher that's the only confusing part about this but other than that this is a really nice system I love the looks of these icons and it gives me the ability to have a dark mode which is better on the eyes and better on the battery anyways folks that's it for me Nev from Nev's Tech Bits app launcher I love this stuff oh wait actually one more thing before I stop you guys gotta check out the wallpapers many beautiful wallpapers red and black red and black folks yeah anyways that's it for me folks like and subscribe if you like this stuff always appreciate it and as always have a good one folks